Hey everybody, how are you doing this evening? That's my evening, maybe not yours. Anyhow, let's get to the point here. I'm your host, InfoGuides is my a name here on YouTube, Twitch, and everywhere else that you'll find me. And in this video, what we're going to be talking about is that right there. We want a wall mount, yep, wall mount CPU case for our salad AI mining rig or rigs, plural, because I do have the hardware. Uh, I just need to set up the second one. So this is what we want, but what we don't want is this. What you can see here is what we don't want is a price tag of $180 just to wall mount this thing. Nope, not gonna happen. Nope, 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 way too expensive. So that's what we want. We like the price tag of this guy over here of $16.95, but they don't quite look the same. So I'm sure I'm not going to get something that looks this nice for that price unless we at least try to do something as a DIY, do it ourselves. And that's what we're here to go over uh, with you guys. We're gonna go, I've got a plan. Yes, I got a plan. I planned it, kinda did that, you know? Anyhow, uh, before we get into the plan, if you like this type of content, please like, subscribe below. Most of all, leave a comment. I need comments, I need interaction, I need your help to get the word out there about my channel. So please, thank you in advance. And now, the idea. You guys like ideas? Let's go ahead. Ideas. First, in order for the idea engine to work, uh, we gotta take a, a mobile camera here over to where the idea, the, the idea is over there. But to get over there, we need one of these to go mobile with. So, uh, bear with me. Here comes Shaky Cam. We want that camera. Wow, yep, it's over there. So right over there, see it? That's the idea, what do you guys think? What do you guys think of that idea? Perfect, right? Yes, that is a great idea. Glad you guys like, oh wait, there. Now the kickstand on my phone's out in the way. What do you think of that idea over there? You like that idea? If so, leave another comment and subscribe down. No, just leave another comment. I need more comments. So leave that down below. Oh, you want to know more about the idea? Fine. Okay, so with me traveling here, uh, hopefully the microphone still picks up just fine. Uh, seems to be where I'm at right now. That's the mic. Yep, it's a, uh, what is this thing? A Blue Yeti. Um, I swapped out my other mic, long story short, but we're now on a Blue Yeti mic. So if it sounds better, let me know. If it sounds worse, don't let me know. Yeah, let me know if it sounds worse. Okay. Oh, that's right. The idea. Okay, the idea. Let's get to it. So first, I need to turn my ugly little mug off. So let's go ahead and hype. There we go. And where the other, oh, I can't turn off all my cameras. Silly me. I just need to turn off that camera. And I'm also going to kick on some overhead lights so you guys can get a better idea of the idea. I'm going to kind of move the mic when I go closer to the idea. Okay, so hopefully that still is Something you guys can hear. Turn down the lights. Here's the idea, guys, right there. Bam, look at that, check it out, woo! Actually, okay, so here's the salad mining rig I have right now. This is the one CPU mining rig that I converted to salad. It's still here, still running salad. I'm not gonna change that. However, I have hardware, identical hardware, other than RAM, for a second one. That's this guy right here. So here's the second. CPU mining rig. I did. I do have some other sticks of memory I threw in there. It's not the the best quality memory, but it'll let it turn on. However, I don't have another NVIDIA video card right now. Um, I got them all in use in my house computers and all that. So I'm in desperate need of an NVIDIA 3060 video card. Just a regular old NVIDIA 30. 
60 video card with 12 gig of RAM. So that way it's pretty much identical to that guy down there. So please hit me up, send me a private message. Let me know that you're interested in sending me one of those for absolutely free. And uh, yeah, I'll be much appreciative. Wall mount idea, right here. So I needed a board, I got a board. I was looking at a couple different ways to mount this. I've done board mounting in the past and I was going to buy a piece of plywood and all that fun stuff. But when I went and looked at the prices of plywood these days, a small piece of actual thick plywood uh, was very expensive. So instead I looked at this just straight up uh, glued together pine board. This thing uh, is about, I remember right, three foot by two foot. And so we got this all set up and I'm just laying pieces and parts out trying to gauge how much space I need. Now, I also came up with an idea, where do I want to wall mount this? Um, by the printer over there, I got a small wall. Oh, here I got a big wall. So I'm thinking somewhere in there. Uh, if you guys can, let me know exactly where in there you think it should go. And so that's where we're going to wall mount it at. And how. So we got the, this is just a really old board. It's junk. I'm just using this to set stuff up and lay things out. And what I would like to do is have the two boards like this, one power supply that will drive each motherboard. Here's where my problem comes in. The power supply cable is long enough where I can reach one motherboard, no problem. But if you guys, I'm sure you guys out there, you've got these splitters. However, these splitters are dirt short. I would love it if I could get a splitter with each splice being like 18 inches or 24 inches in length. So if you know somebody out there with a splitter or selling splitters for power supplies of that length, in all seriousness, I would like to know about it. Uh, so instead, what I had to do was kind of corny and probably not recommended because of just more potentials for loss. So I had to buy uh, some extension cables. And even the extension cables are only, I think, 10 inch extensions. But if I put a 10 inch extension on that guy and a 10 inch extension on that guy, I should be able to have this guy reach this guy and that guy reach that guy. And all together, we'll have both guys attached to this guy so we'll have a bunch of guys. Let me know what you think. Uh, and then obviously once I uh, have a, an idea of the layout of this, uh, I'm going to cut off the excess board. We're going to cut this off. We're going to cut in a French cleat so we can attach it to the wall. Somewhere in there. And then once we have it attached to the wall, I'm just going to use a metal clip on the top edge and it's going to be a Z-clamp. Uh, I got them right here. A little Z-clamp. I'm going to take one, maybe two of those. Just put it over the lip of this. And I'm going to make sure I get it sunk into a stud. And so, all in all, this setup, if it works out, besides these extensions, besides these, if this works out, the board cost me $13.95. I need some metal clips. I'll explain those in the future video. I need some metal clips. These here are 89 cents each. I got three of them. And I need a Z clamp. These are 89 cents each. I just had to order it in a 12 pack off the internet. So there we go with that. And that should be all I need. So in other words, Maybe $2.50, another dollar, so $3.50, and then $14. We're at about $17.50 for the whole setup. Yeah, $17.50 for a wall mount. Can I make it look nice? That's the question. That's the plan. So 
we're going to stop here because I don't want to spoil it for you guys. And we're going to stop this video here, but stay tuned for a future video where we're going to go over uh, the, the build process. I'll, I'll show clips of that as well as getting it mounted somewhere, somewhere in there. Um, and what that will do for me is it gets it out from under here where underneath here is collecting more heat than I would like. That's why I have an old box fan pointed at it during the day just to circulate the air under there. So I need the microphone back over here. Hopefully this. That's the idea. What do you guys think? I think I'm just a pure genius. Um. Yeah, so if I've done my math right, I should be able to get something like this for a price tag like this. Oh, you can't see that. Okay, one second. Realize that. I'm shrinking. Anyhow, you should be able to get a price tag like this guy way over there. Sorry. Something that looks similar to that guy way over there, but for a price tag of the guy there. So hopefully you think I can do it. I'm sure I can do it. Like, subscribe, let me know your comments and thoughts. And that's it for this video. Until next time, I'm InfoGuides, and I'm here to show you what little I know.